What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the episode 22 of the podcast, the Lunch Table Podcast. Yes, sir. I see you forgot. Me, but I seen you about to correct me, but <laughs> as, you, as you can hear by my voice, I'm sick. A little bit sick. I'm getting over it right now. Like, you feel me? Hey, hey, not hey, even sick. I think he's just under them. What do you think about his immune system? Think it's a little weak? Oh, my Nah, God. I think it's pretty strong. <laughs> think it's pretty strong? <laughs> I think it's pretty strong. Yeah. I ain't been sick. Off camera. Dick no ride. Yeah, dick ride. <laughs> dick ride. Dick ride. Dick ride. Hey, um, if it's my boy Dari, bro, you know I'm riding, bro. I'm saying. But, <laughs> the- <laughs> oh, wait, what? <laughs> Pause. But yeah, uh, him being sick is kind of funny because it <clears throat> kind of ties in. No, not really. <laughs> it does not, bro. But today we're going to talk about the main focus is, is on uh, addictions, but let's enough chatting. Let, let's get into it. So the first subtopic that uh, we're gonna talk about, kind of ease into it, is um, porn addiction. Right, we're old enough, right? No, of right yeah. Break. But how do we start this? Well, why do people watch porn? Right. Start out simple. Mm-hmm. Well, now in the gratification and the yeah. yeah in the twenty tens, little boys have been watching it more, so you just get hooked on it like that. Yeah, when you're a little kid, you're gonna. Just... I ain't gonna lie. When I was younger, bro, she, I was addicted to porn. I'll, I'll <laughs> no, admit that, but I'll, it's I'll, like a new discovery, bro. Yeah. Like when you're real young, like it's easy. I think that's why it's so addictive. Yeah. Yeah. Is at our age, we can watch it whenever, wherever we want, and it's like a new discovery the at one point. Thing, like yeah. you don't have to find magazines under your dad's. Okay. Bed, you know? Yeah. Back in the day, like yeah, <laughs> hey, back in the day, it was, it was like Playboys, <laughs> and they would look at it. You know, you don't really see that now. Like. Like, bro, I'm renting, I'm renting some DVDs this weekend. Yeah. <laughs> it's that not is, go that's down. weird, though. The guy from my that's job, he said he had to pay 100 bucks a week. I, but I'll, just, I'll just use my imagination. Like that for <laughs> that little hey, you got to no, be strong to no, do that. No, but back then, how would you that, imagine bro? it if like, if you've never gotten pussy? That's what I'm saying. Oh, no, but he, he was he was talking about when he was a teenager. He said it was No, hard. I'm saying like back no, no, then. No, 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 that's no, not, yeah, no, that. no, but that's what I'm saying. You got to be, you have, you got to be strong to be able to imagine it and still let one go. Yeah, that's, that's a good I mean, you that's a good you imagination, do. but I don't know. <laughs> can you, you gotta be like, <laughs> would you be able to do that? I can do I'm it. I'm thinking of hella details, bro. I'm thinking of hella details. <laughs> I think you it, probably gotta, you probably I gotta, gotta be, remember like a certain. It, I gotta like, be hella. You know? I gotta be hella. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> I gotta be hella horny to really be like, got a little flashback. Imagine, like, you know what I mean? Damn! Yeah. Like, really you was that horny? <laughs> you fucking imagine the scenario. Yeah, I, would, I wouldn't say I was personally addicted. That's like the same addicted. having like a wet dream, though. Like, if you really get real horny, you get a wet dream. I think if yeah. I really get horny, I could, I could imagine. But that's I, natural. I, I, I gotta be like, like, you know, like a wet dream is literally your body's like saying, "Bro, you need to bust this." <laughs> like, it needs to get out yeah, of wet here. Wet dreams are the best, though. They're pretty fire. Bro. I wouldn't say I was personally addicted yeah, to what? it when I, I first got into it, but like I had an issue with it. <laughs> I had an issue with it. What? With. Big booty bitches. Uh, jagging off, say jagging off. Yeah, I yeah. think, bro, I think every young man. No, I don't care about saying it. I think every young man. Bro, 90% of the, I think I was, nobody. I think I was in third grade. It's good was, to masturbate. Oh, what are you talking about? No, it's, no, it's not. Bro, it is. No, like, not. you were shooting, yeah, okay, okay, okay. okay. shooting blanks. Not over, <laughs> not overdoing it. No, but like, not, 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 you're not supposed to do it at all, bro. That's a sin too. Hold on, when'd you start? When'd you start? Hey, when'd you start? Okay, now it's a sin. Yeah, but I don't think it is. When'd you start, Oscar? Huh? When'd you start? I don't know. I, I wouldn't know. Hey, bro, my mom, was, my mom was watching this. Okay, what'd you start? Me? Sixth grade is... That's cool. I think so. When'd you start? Yeah, probably middle school. I can't, like, pinpoint okay. it. I started, like, seventh grade. Yeah. When'd you start? Seventh grade. Bro, he's wildin'. When'd you start? Third grade. Bro, he's... Nah, nah, nah. But look, no, but I tell you, you it wasn't me, though. That's why I, I, I didn't look it up, though. That's why I stopped. I stopped Wait, because, what? I stopped because... It was, you, was, huh? you was having a watch party? Now I was having a sleepover with the with the with a buddy of mine. At the time, and he's like, bro, <laughs> "Look at this." And I was like, "What the fuck? Change your life, bro. Yeah, I was like, "What the fuck? That's crazy!" I can't wait for you to leave so I can look this shit up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bro. No, that, that's why I stopped. I stopped because it's sin. Bro, you know what's really? hello funny? Yeah. Joe, 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 y'all can laugh. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm. So you tell me you ain't rubbing no, no, out? You, you can no. You can, you can laugh, bro. Yeah, I made a promise. No, to no, God. I'm not laughing. I'm not laughing. No, I don't care. I made a promise to God. I'm not gonna do it again. Really? I promise. Damn, I, Damn. He's about to strike you down when you. Well, that, means you can't, I'm not that, that means you can't fuck no so, bitches unless you're making kids. No, I'm jacking off. I know, but you also can't do that. Yeah. Well, I, I, I don't know. I haven't, I haven't looked at the verse or anything. Unless you put. I don't know. What verse is that? When does it yeah, say that? No, but you, unless you put a ring on it, you can't. <laughs> See, no, you can't, you can't talk assumptions. I'm talking. We're talking like. Like no, the verse that I've seen. No, I, I he said, "Damn, how that should go?" I searched it up. <laughs> I searched it up. I don't remember. No, but isn't it like you have to be married, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think so. I don't. So you gonna wait? If if that's the truth, then yeah, I'll, 
I'll probably do it. Yeah, it is. It is. You strong hey, up here, hey, buddy. That's you, that's you bro. I hella did forget about that verse. Yeah, <laughs> right? I respect that. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Before, no, that's man. respect, but that's... But, yeah, I wouldn't do but it. But you know what's crazy? Remember in middle school, they was watching porn in class? <laughs> they were so fucking horny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Because, oh, yeah. <laughs> hey. 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 Now they would take my iPod and put porn on it. Oh, And Mr. French. Hey, hey, bro, it was just, French it was just a no, joke. No, actually, I think you were the first person that has ever, like, even, I think you were the one that showed me, bro. <laughs> For you would just walk around and fucking show everybody, like, yeah, nothing. Bro, bro, shut the fuck like, up. Nah, I remember in French, bro, you did that like, too, bro. He used to, he used to, he used to, used to have me. fucking videos that I'd be like, same, draw same. drops. Same. I'd be like, <laughs> bro, what the fuck hey, are bro, you so watching? Hey, hold on, hold on. He showed a whole fist on the vagina, bro. He showed a whole what the fuck? Feel hey, bro. Bro. Hey, 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 I'm about to expose you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hold on, I'm about sorry. to expose hold you, on, but it's on, not like on. it's not like super. It's not like I don't think it's bad. <laughs> Felix, one day he showed me a fucking or sent me a fucking picture of someone's vagina open with milk and cereal <laughs> in it. <laughs> Wait, Wait he would send shit like that. They were eating cereal. That's not porn. It's like it's like bro. I was like bro. Wait, so tell me you never seen that till freshman year, bro? Not freshman year. That was freshman year. I had, you're the only uh, one I've seen it from. I've never seen it. I've seen it. I don't know who I've seen. Did I see it? Wait, with the cereal thing? No, I don't think I've seen it. Yeah, no, but yeah, cause you, no, you but would I, be like, that's hey. they would post it on Instagram and shit. I, wait, what? In elementary school, I remember people used to bring it. Oh, two girls in one cut? Nasty uh, ass shit. I remember that in third grade. Nasty bro. ass shit. I remember, I remember that I couldn't grade. eat chocolate ice cream for like, <laughs> and I used to love chocolate. After that, I was like, hell no. After but, that, I started well, liking it. Going back to Ramon said that it's um, <laughs> a good to do it like once in a while. That's the reason why I would do it. Even before I said like I would yeah, stop. It's healthy. Mm-hmm. But for me personally, like now, now that I'm doing it, I, I feel like it's just more, I have more mental clarity. And it's not even that I want to do it, but I see research that says that's the only reason if you I do see- it, it reduces your uh, it's a chances lie, of bro. Yeah, it's testicular a, it's, cancer. They want to keep you in it's fertile, a bro. It's a lie. <laughs> you know, you know, we it have goes the, back to the same thing. Right? Hold on, hold on. Look, you know, we have the same testosterone rates as uh, as sixty five year old men in the sixties and fifties. Oh, you, Us they, being young right they now, could, in our prime. They could still like have Why? kids and shit. That's crazy. Yeah. What, what happened? Is that good or bad? No, or that's hella bad. The wait, less testosterone you have, we wait, have why? the same. Is it because like we're all like addicted to porn? Well, not all. No, uh, no, 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 that, that has that has or, that has something to do with it. That has something to do with it. But uh, it's also like microplastics and the food, our diet. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's, yeah, our diet like, and stuff. We're dying off, bro. Yes, yeah, so I'm saying 65 year old man. In, yeah, that's crazy. In the 60s, yeah, has more testosterone than any man alive. And now. what the testosterone is like? Is that like drive and shit or like what? That's what that's it? about it drive. Builds about power. It's, it's what makes you a man, bro. Yeah, basically. Yeah, I know, but you muscle, you know, sex. Yeah, but shit. I'm talking about like in terms of like uh, how you say it, because they because the females have it too, but they just have it at a very low level. That's why it's harder for them to lose weight. Like yeah, you said. yeah, but I'm saying like, what what does it do with like uh, how you say it, like personality wise? I can't. I wouldn't be able to well, describe it for you. Well, if if you have hella testosterone, you're probably you know all fucking hairy. You you know you're bigger. It doesn't oh. necessarily mean you're uh, low T if you're not big and you know hairy, but but usually yeah when you're you know, big and buff, like big old shoulders and like yeah. facial hair. That, that usually means. Yeah, because I remember, I remember uh, we learned this in anthropology. Uh, and that supposedly the second we male. We chilling, bro. Actually, I hey, this, me too. Bro. And I wasn't oh, going to be one hand. You be shaving, bro? No. I had to. Stop it, bro. Do you be shaving? <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Look like you just nah. going back right What's that? <laughs> nah, but yeah, supposedly uh, my leg. in anthropology, we learned that the second male, that kind of relates to what we said. The second male, like, like if your mom had like an older brother, I mean like an older kid, and you were the second uh, oldest male, that the chances of you being like a homosexual and shit were higher because the t- uh high s- what's the estrogen? That's what it's called. Estrogen. estrogen. The thought, female. The I female. thought it was the last one, the last kid. Well, yeah, the more the more it is. Oh yeah. Because like their their body learns after the first one. Oh, we need more estrogen. So like you know like I guess biologically you have more chances of. Damn, you know? bro, I'm a second kid, bro. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna come in next Wait, time. so, so, so. <laughs> I have, I have three sisters and I'm the youngest boy. Oh, oh no, 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 but you have an older so, brother? No. Oh, so you're, so they yeah. saved yeah, all I don't believe that. Saved all no, it's true, it's true. They saved uh, all nothing wrong with being gay. Or we're just, it's just saying, like, <laughs> no, you know, it's crazy. Nah, it, but this is different. I'm, I'm gonna just say this because this is a whole different topic, but like, one of my cousin's uh, girlfriend, she was like, oh yeah, uh, children are born gay. I was like, that doesn't make any sense at all. 
But that's a different topic. That's another podcast. Yeah, that's another podcast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't believe that. Yeah. So Trans- back, but it ties into what he said. That's why I said I don't believe that. Going back to porn or whatnot, like, um, it was, like, today in today's standards, it's just, like, I see why it's so, like, addictive it's just so you know you know one of the be- one of the reasons why is because it, it gives a fake reality it gives yeah that and it's, it's also it's so accessible like we just talked about yeah. it like back then it was we're talking like playboy like magazines they make uh, it there's the girl though. with their boobs out right now if you want to look up brazilian fart fetish porn anything <laughs> anything, anything you can pull that up right now yeah, but that's what i'm saying it starts at the top because they make it accessible they they want you to get addicted to that shit, right? Yeah. That's what you, that you have to understand. Yeah, that's why that. these guys can't get hard because they get they need a Brazilian bitch farting. Yeah. I got that from South Park. I don't I don't look that. Up. It's con- it's con- I don't know, man. That was too dis- <laughs> that was too specific. It, it, it literally tells you. I got some. Nah, from South Park. I, you, know, you remember that episode, right? Randy, when there was no computer, nah. and he's like, uh, he was saying Brazilian fart fetish porn, and the guy was drawing because the computer wasn't real. Oh, I think I yeah, okay, thank God, bro. Thank God, he, he knows what I'm talking about, bro. Like, because there, if you guys uh, don't watch South Park, is <laughs> Like, there's there's weird. a Jordan Peterson quote that, that I, when I was watching like for this off topic. Who the fuck is that? You know Jordan Peterson? <laughs> we brought him nah, up like three times. Just pretty much the quote was, how can you adapt to reality when you falsify it? Mm-hmm. It was pretty much just like, porn is all fake. Like yep. the way they, if you see like the, the scenes and shit, like it's all scripted and it's, yeah. it's, that's not how it is. But people who are addicted to that shit, they have that sense of reality that, oh, this is how it's supposed to be. Yeah, but I don't think well, I mean, everyone. Not. Well, I mean, if you've been, think about it, if you've been watching this since you were a kid, like, and you, because no, you, no, you learn the sex is from that. That point, that I'm saying that it's for those two um, who are I mean, addicted to it. I mean, isn't family life like in fifth grade, though? Like, yeah, yeah, they only, tell, they only yeah. tell you about the weenie and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> no, they, they taught it for the me. The weenie and the For us, they taught us about everything, but just like, not about all that other fucking extra shit. I don't think that was your so teacher. So they taught you about everything, but not, <laughs> but not everything. <laughs> no, like everything, but like, I'm talking about like, they didn't get deep into like, they they told us like, what, well, not how, everything. how sex worked and everything. But I'm saying like, they didn't get into detail. Like, <laughs> so I, said, hey, I remember my fifth grade teacher was like, does it feel good? Yeah, it feels good. That's, why, that's why everybody what? be doing it. <laughs> I was like, like you as the hey, you know what? You I know guess. what? That's uh, there was a teacher in middle school too that, 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 uh, told my sister that uh, one of my friends' sister asked him like, "Oh, does it feel good to get to get fucked?" The teacher was like, "Oh yeah, it feels like you're getting stabbed, but it feels good." What? I was like, "What? What? Oh, that's a good dude to get no. stabbed? That's the bitch got stabbed before." <laughs> <laughs> it was it was the teacher. I, I'll tell you off camera who, uh, who it was. I don't remember the name. Uh, I know. I know. Uh, is that uh, I think I gotta bitch? guess too. Uh, the bro. science teacher. Hate that bitch. You know what I'm talking about? Okay. Yeah, I know. Stupid about. bitch. The the bitch that tripped over. <laughs> Oh, uh, we so, talked about so, it. Come on. Yeah, I don't know. A teacher said that for the that's kind of like we should put like. Oh no no. <laughs> 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 but I think I think this also relates to like um <laughs> when guys are like uh kind of like the example that I gave that one guy that was uh, hyping up that one girl who was fat. It, it's kind of like post nut syndrome too. Like people uh, people are like. Chasing Wait, this that syndrome? She's trying to get her yeah. nut. Chasing exactly. the nut. Yeah. And, and, it, and it clogged up their mind because like, oh, bro, I got to fuck this girl so bad. Like, I'm going to tell her everything. Oh, yeah. You know you get what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. It, I think it kind of said that. I've, never, so heard, so I've <laughs> never heard it called that. I've heard of post-nut clarity, but not post-nut. It's the same syndrome. thing. Oh, he did say syndrome. Yeah, I never heard syndrome. Yeah. Syndrome? It's the same thing. That's what I heard. I might be wrong. Syndrome and clarity, same shit. Same shit. Syndrome. Yeah. I thought clarity is after... I I'm like say I'm after you up. bust your nut, cause I thought it was like, oh, you bust your nut, and you're like, damn, bro, I really just busted a nut. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's I mean. not I supposed to happen though. Wrong. You're huh? supposed to want to. Apparently, you're supposed to want to cuddle with the woman. Yeah, but with. why would you have? You know why? That's you, what I'm saying. But the yeah. bitch is ugly and fat. You're exactly. not gonna want to stay. You're gonna exactly. leave. And then that's the thing with that's jacking off too. Yeah, with jacking off too, you're supposed to feel the warmth of a woman's body or whatever. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. I yeah, guess that's why. That's like the imagination thing. That's remember that movie you told me. Uh, the guy that jacked off, he, like you. he was handsome and, and like muscular and everything, but oh, he yeah, wanted to jack. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. That's why it was so weird for him to be with the woman. Because after he jacks off, he's used yeah, to be. Yeah, it's this movie called Don John, and it's about like what we're talking about. It's this dude, he gets like females, like he's like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like, he's able to do all of that. He's good looking, like on the standards. Yeah, he's yeah. buff, all this, but he's addicted to porn. Like he likes porn yeah. more. That just than, shows how addictive people, it is, right? People who are addicted to they have low self esteem and like social uh, anxiety. Not mm-hmm. always. Remember, Terry Crews was addicted to it, and he could oh, get yeah, any, any woman that. he I wants. That, you know, that, like that, rich, that. famous. You know, he's it's not, he's weird because it's it's like like I used to think like that too. Like it's because this it's because of that. 
but I think the main thing is like it's just like food, like it's accessible, and then people just like, bro, addiction is so simple. Like, and, like I feel like a lot of people uh, simple but not overcomplicated. Yeah, I feel like it's simple because yeah, and everybody yeah. overcomplicates. Like it's yeah, as simple yeah. as like being addicted to food. You could just eat when you're bored, yeah. and then that just yeah. turns into something bigger, like porn. Like you could just be sitting there bored, and then just like, well, isn't it so accessible? Like we were just talking about. And then you just start watching it every and, single morning. And, and personally, just, when I when I when that when I would do it, and I because I'd be bored, bro, I'd be so pissed at myself. Yeah, I'd yeah. be like, why? And then the next time you bored, bro, you do it again. Again, bro. yeah, yeah. And you, just, yeah, yeah. I think that, that was me with cigarettes for a little bit. Like I'd just be bored. Like there's nothing going on at work, and you see, we could just go outside. Yeah, I'd be like I might as well. You know, accessible. It's accessible. It, it pisses me but, off. But the huh? thing is, it doesn't even make me feel good. It just makes me feel like, anxious exactly. and shit. I'd be like, like, like I'm why, feeling this some time, bro. Like, yeah. But you yeah. stopped though? That's good. Uh, yeah, I'm stopping. Uh, today I ran pretty hard and my, my chest started hurting. So I'm like, yeah, I got to quit that shit. For you went for a run? Not not a run, but we were playing we were playing soccer outside in the courtyard. Oh, bro. Yeah. That's it. That's so it. we were running a good amount. That's far. All right. Well, we're going to play got, soccer again, bro. I should. I, I, I'm thinking of joining the team. Yeah, let me know. I got, a, I got a question. If you guys want to. I'll, I'll, I'll answer it. And if you guys want to answer it, you go ahead. But <laughs> what is your personal record? Record. Personal record. record. What? Like in a day? In a day. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, I'll be honest. I'll be like honest. Mine? Mine? Like <laughs> my, oh, hell no. Nah. No. Nah. <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you what mine. You if you want to answer it, you go ahead. I'll hey, wait. wait. My, oh, okay, go ahead, go ahead. I've never spanked my shit more than three times. Mine is, yeah. mine is eight. <laughs> what the what fuck? What the fuck? I see, bro. And, and why nah. you turn this into something like, yeah, I just had more tests. I was throwing out Kim You got, You probably can't do it eight times. Watch him turn it into that, bro. Am I saying it? You know, that's oh, yeah. how, that sounds crazy. <laughs> that sounds crazy, but uh, that, that's your, like, one day. That was just one day, right? Yeah, that was. but that was, like... But was it one know. of our friends? Boy, said, woke, in one week? And that boy, I woke, <laughs> that boy woke up at five in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> the whole on the whole day. <laughs> now, there's this guy. I seen the video of this guy. He looked like a, you know, whoa, like a soy whoa. boy, like a weird guy. And he's like, oh, yeah, I, I do. He, he made it so weird because he's like, oh, yeah, I do self-love. <laughs> Uh, he says, <laughs> "Wait, what? Yeah, he calls, like, like I can pull up the video. Spanking this shit. He calls it self love. Yeah. <laughs> what? He was spanking it. He was spanking it. Six, Man, he, said, piss me off. he says he's been, he's been spanking it six times a day, seven days a week for the past he's, ten years. He's been loving himself six times. He's a been day. loving himself. Yeah, go love yourself, man. You fucking loser." <laughs> He's trying to defend it. He's, he's like, oh, yeah, because I support women's content. Like, so, oh, so, of course, of course. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Hold on. But oh. look, he's, he was like, so you s- telling me to jack off less? That's hurt. That's like sexist. And like, it's hurting women and stuff. Man, I was like, up. bro, you're going to hurt women. Yeah, when- those, are, those are the people that are like, so I heard it. Well. I would say for me, it was probably <laughs> for surely. Under are you five, mad? Bro. I was, I was sarcastic. Uh, what were you yeah, saying? For me, it would be like under five. Under five, but be honest, bro. Yeah, it's, no, for it's real. just a safe space, bro. No, for real, like under five. <laughs> safe space. Uh, if you want to ask at, at that answer. point, <laughs> at that point, it's like, bro, like, I don't know. I did, I did, for eight, no, I don't know. I, you know why I pushed eight? I was like, let me just see how far I can go, bro. Are you for real? At eight, I wasn't dropping nah, shit. I ain't gonna lie. I wasn't dropping <laughs> shit. <laughs> you shooting blanks. Nothing. <laughs> you running out of ammo. Nah, shooting blanks. I was shooting blanks. It's kind of crazy because eight times because I see what Ramon's saying. Like, right. like you get posting like clarity right. every you single time. <laughs> <laughs> so every. <laughs> 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 no, you know what's even funnier? How many times you friends, did it? I don't have the, I don't have the record. Yeah, yeah. You don't. Someone has nine. Someone has nine. Someone has nine. Don't you no, don't expose them. Nine? I th- oh, it was more. I might. Be, I heard eleven. I need to. What the? I don't know who it is, but don't. Bro, what's it? Remember? Look, this I literally remember like. that conversation. Oh my god! Look, this is what the guy looks like. Of course. You see, you can see the idea of. Like you, you like come on. Bro. He looked yeah. like. Bro, I remember one time you told me that. that one time somebody like busted a nut like fourteen times in a day Mel, and they died. Fourteen. <laughs> That's what you told me. No, yeah. it was one hundred and four times. Yeah. Oh, oh, what the? Fuck? <laughs> it was on Valentine's Day. What? Uh, like twenty fuck. something. He was loving himself actually. He was what? loving himself too much. Hey, I, hey, hey Adore, I thought I was flexing, bro. It was it was 104 I thought I was flexing. Why you shitting on you, bro? One hundred and four. One hundred and four is. I think. Hold on. One hundred and four. I think. I think it was higher. I think it was higher. That's four times every hour. <laughs> he was going yeah. ham. Oh shit! Nah, I mean that. He so he kept going. He didn't sleep. He didn't sleep or nothing. Oh, That's the thing too. I know. You gotta go quick. Yeah. All right. Let's say oh, you're shit. you're up in the day for uh, 104. He must, he must have taken like 10 run Nah, bro. Bro. nah, bro. He was for Chelsea. If he was he awake in the day for 12 hours, he did it eight times an hour, bro. Oh no! Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. Okay, my bad, my bad, my bad. It wasn't 104. Oh, okay. It was, it was 40, 42, 42 times. That's still crazy. That's still a lot. Yeah, but it was in Brazil though. And he did that. 
Huh? He, he did died? die? 16 year old mess uh, died after mass- 16. Ooh, I'm what? trying not to laugh, bro. Hold on. That's kind of crazy. Masturbating 42 times without stopping. Oh, without stopping. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Because your heart be beating. I mean, not that I would know, but <laughs> your heart be beating hella fast when you jack up. So 42 times? He be making love to himself, but. I'd be yeah, you like that. You be wiggling and shit. I'd be like this. I'd be stimulating my nipples. It be, it be that boy, that boy on the toilet, the fucking bathroom, hella steamy. Uh, he be moving all the way, be like, this. oh yeah, me, uh-huh. oh, yeah, that. <laughs> <laughs> you done in there? Oh, hey, remember that episode bro. of Family Guy when Quagmire like first discovered the like internet porn, and then his arms. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. I think, I think it was. I don't think it was because of the jizz though. I think it was because he died from lack of food or water. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. So, he, so he sat there. Yeah, because isn't that using up like energy? Times. Yeah, oh, crazy right. amount of energy. Yeah. Because I'll be honest too, like, it, it affects you physically. You feel tired like the next yeah. day. Like, you just like drain. The next day? On, yeah. The, the next thing day. they don't tell you though is how long he was sitting there jerking his shit. It's 42 times? Because I, 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 I reckon after the third time you have to like, he like, had no you have clarity. Put in work. <laughs> you had to put in work. I mean, after the tenth time, oh, forty-two I didn't even times. Know, I didn't even know it's forty-two times. No thoughts. Yeah, how straight jerking yeah, off. Yeah, and they counted. They counted the lows on his, <laughs> on his chest. <laughs> yeah. Or, I mean, I guess the amount of cum. I guess. I, oh wait, because he sat through it. You think he cleaned it up or he just? Uh, he must have done some weird yeah, shit. Or, I mean, I mean, I think, I think. I think uh, they can do some pretty cool shit with the uh, not, not, <laughs> what? Not, what? No, not vasectomies with autopsies. Autopsies. They can probably mm-hmm. tell how many times. Oh, yeah, because like, like, his Cowper's gland is burnt out. Bro. Can do some pretty cool shit with black lights. <laughs> <laughs> bro, he's all like, whoa. <laughs> you ain't a scientist, man. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I think yeah. autopsies. You could so, you could tell some pretty good some good shit. Crazy, some cool bro. shit. See, with, he died uh, with his dick in his hands. Literally, crazy. Bro. like a G, like a G. <laughs> Nah, think, yeah, that's a G. It's balls. Nah, that's not a G, bro. bro. That's to me, to me, yeah. You down bad, son. I, I don't mean, know. I mean, the the work he put in was interesting. You gotta respect 42 it. Forty two times. Maybe yeah, the fact that they right? could tell. Like, what the, oh, it's probably more. If they could tell it was forty times, they they're probably off a little bit. It's probably more. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. Because you gotta right. start shooting blanks out at a point, bro. Yeah, right. So I mean, what with the how much could you tell with the That's what I'm saying. It had to be like his first time ever discovering anything. And he was like, uh, "No, actually, I think it was because how is he so? Nah, sixteen. He nah, sixteen. He's already times? into. It. I mean, no, but like how sixteen in Brazil. To, they didn't if, have you're, best if you're used to watching it, how would you be able to go forty two times? You know what I mean? She must have just, I just don't get it. But that shit crazy. Like, like at one point, you're like, "Nah, no, no, I gotta no, stop." It wasn't his first time. And I'm surprised you die after the 40 seconds. I'm, I'm like, like nah, why not like, 41, bro? Look, 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 hold on. The young man began to masturbate to at midnight. 43. Yeah. Hey, look, 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 look. So it wasn't his first time discovering it. He said, uh, "This young man, the young man, began to masturbate at midnight and spent the whole night to compulsively touch himself." At school, his classmates commented on the boy's problem and said he asked them to connect to the webcam for being observed. Hey yo! The further that that this that his attraction to women was extreme, he was attracted to all kinds of women, regardless of texture, physics, color, and age. All right, so that's respectable. He didn't care. <laughs> you were just <laughs> no. But yeah, in his room, a great amount of pornography was found, including photographs and videos of nude women that were saved on his PC. Saved. Man, so that means he didn't. He didn't. He wasn't going through. He just seen the first video on Pornhub, and you were just like, "Let me go in." Yeah, he probably was trying to like. You know how like uh. Well, I don't know. He had no taste. You know how X videos? <laughs> that like, too. Like all the first ones on the homepage. You bro. said this one. Right. Like, I, got, I gotta watch all of them. They all seem interesting. Bro, I used to I spend gotta so much time to you find like the right going video. Back, going back. I used to spend so much time trying to find like a good video and shit. Man. Crazy time. Cause you're like, nah, this was not worthy. Yeah, and yeah. I'm not about to waste. I, I, need, I need something better than this. <laughs> Cause look, me, bro. Oh shit! Hold on. He said, I, I like this one. Me, I, I need the context. Uh-huh. I need it. I say need it. I say need. It. I needed that. Con- hey, it, it, it built- hey, Oscar, they they don't need context. Bro. Oh, you need it. <laughs> they, hey, they don't need context from last episode, brother. They, oh. they, don't, they don't need context. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's another guy That's in the good. Bronx. There's another man in the Bronx. He was 51. Uh, they say, times? Yeah, they don't they don't know how many times, but they oh. said several times a day. We said he had a stroke. Yeah, that's look, what look, they say self love here too. However, one explosive self love session went all a wire when after climaxing the serial the serial stroker was <laughs> <laughs> this, this motherfucker had a stroke and they're like the serial stroker. Ah, oh, nah, was struck oh. down by. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucked up. Oh, no. So look, 
<laughs> One explosive self love session went a wire when after climaxing the serial stroker was struck down by thunderclap headaches and severe violence. thunderclap. But they should nah, like, choose like, the think, words, bro. Think about, it. think about it. They try to sneak that self love bullshit in. Hey, wait, think about you know, it. Wait, wait, wait. Hold think on. I was it. about to say that to you. They're 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 making it acceptable. They're making it like, some, they, like, they, like these fuckers think they're slick. <laughs> These fucking bitches, bro. Wait, we have, a, high, we have a higher record. We, we have, have a, a new record. record. Ding, ding, ding. Da- <laughs> Daily Pakistan, a uh, man dies after masturbating 62 times in a row on Valentine's Day. A 33-year-old single man from South Africa died on Valentine's Day. Oh, he was single? Uh, yeah, I want to know how they know. That's, that's, not, that's not a gene. I, I want to know how, how they know how many times. 62. That's interesting. Oh, yeah, it was from depression, doing to be extremely lonely on Valentine's Day. At 30, you said nah, 33? But Whoa, look. The young, the young man was on his bed. His penis was detached from his body. It must have been so intense it just came off his body. That's got to be fake. He found his penis gripped on his left hand. Left hand? Oh, no, no. Okay, that's fake. <laughs> what? Yeah. How is it off his body? <laughs> and it's on his left hand. <laughs> hey, look, look, look. Right, right. It should be in his right hand. Look, let's read the comments. Look, look. <laughs> let's read the comments. Look. How in the hell do they know how many times? He said he crossed off on the... Wait, what? That boy, that boy was, what the fuck? Was he, he was on a mission. I said he crossed off on a wall every time he nutted. I was on oh, my right hand tired, bro. Wait, how do you, how do you, what the fuck? Bro, just pulled it out of left hand. Oh. Nah, bro. Oh, look, this guy. Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck? That's crazy. <laughs> Well, now it's just getting into weird, into weird stories about people who died. With this guy put a man, the, this is man put a dildo up his butt, yeah. and he died. Nah, and he I died. think. Oh I wait, think, whoa! All right, last, whoa. One, last, last one. With the last story. one. Last, last one, one. Last one. Last one. Look, one fateful day late in the. Uh, 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 he's from London. Makes makes sense. Londoners are fucking. <laughs> They're crazy motherfuckers, bro. No, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> Bunch of fucking. <laughs> uh, one fateful day late in 2013, he accidentally lodged the vibrator so far up his ass, or so far up his crapper. Uh, <laughs> crapper. Look, look, that he found it impossible to extract. He was also so humiliated by the entire sequence of events that he refused to seek help until five days later, at which the the at which point the little buzzing fake penis had already punctured his colon. Oh my god. Whoa, so he had a vibrating dildo up his ass for five days. I don't feel so good. Yeah. <laughs> you have a stomach ache? Something oh. like that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, is that your, hey, is that your phone? Hey, no. <laughs> That's your phone? Hey, John, phones, somebody phones get that. Off in- <laughs> That's his hey, motherfucking I can't get off, bro. He said, he said, <laughs> he went to your phone. He went to the doctor, he said, so have you been doing anything unusual lately? Eating different? He said, I don't know. I, I don't know. I kept my finger on it. Nothing different. He didn't shit for five days. Yeah. With a vibrate, because when you have to shit, anything like makes you want to shit. This yeah. shit was vibrating in the stomach. <laughs> so, oh, I got a boo boo. <laughs> he didn't try to shit it out. <laughs> he, was, <laughs> <laughs> he was straining it. <laughs> hey, Vane. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Oh, yeah, we got right. a side chat. To, 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 to end, end it off, to end the porn uh, segment off real quick, is. Don't jack off. Don't touch yeah, yourself. Don't do it. Ever. Don't do it. It's now against God's will. It's a sin. You can do it sometimes. Nah. Mm-hmm. Do it when you want to do it, but just don't overdo it. If you want to go to hell, yes, you can do it every once in a while. <laughs> but but fuck. if you want to go to the kingdom of heaven <laughs> with me and Oscar, yeah, uh, go up. See, and, and don't take it um, out of context. But what we're saying is, it's like it's not easy. That's like we're not saying it's not easy. Nah, yeah, but it's possible. If you repent. Any religion, <laughs> right. you're going to have. <laughs> All right, last subtopic. Um, going into drugs. Oh, uh, you want the time? Uh, yeah. Drugs is a little harder. One hour, yeah. Okay, sorry. The drugs. Drugs, and then we're talking about six too, right? Yeah. Next to it. Hey, what? Like drugs huh? counts as the same category as cigarettes, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah right. For sure. Nicotine. I, I guess I'll start off with the with the question that I. I Look uh, at me, fool. <laughs> <laughs> the question that I uh, brought up earlier. I don't feel so uh, good. What is the motive for someone to try it? Mm. You know, for peer the first pressure, time. Uh, stress, stress. Some of the, uh, so there's Depression. that. I, I had put down social glorification, peer pressure, uh, grieving, reduce the stress, and then boredom. Mm. Yeah, you know, I feel yeah. uh, sti- yeah, the stigma around it, right? Yeah. That, that's the same thing. So, um, so it's like I don't know. It's so weird because if you if you go to a party, you know, light up a cigarette, people are like, "What? The f- 
the fuck is this dude doing? You know, like what? The, what he, but if it's a, if it's you know weed, weed, they're like, oh, like yeah, you know. But it's like they're both crazy. equally as bad for your lungs. You know. Yeah. Actually, so that's, uh, that's been debunked. All right, uh, <laughs> guys, weed is less bad for you. Yeah, it's less. Are more harmful. Oh, so you're more harmful. Yeah. Now. Okay, that, that makes sense. They have more toxins. Than you can still get lung cancer from it though. Well, yeah. And oh no, for and, sure. And the way weed smokers smoke, they smoke. When they smoke, they don't smoke like every once in a while. Every once in a while, you know. Yeah, the, like the ones that are smoke bad with every it? day. Yeah, yeah. So I know. Yeah. Tobacco uh, is the number one thing, right? You, you can find that in uh yeah yeah sw- yeah you can find that in like swishers, you know, blunts or whatever. Uh, but a lot of people take it off, but it, the residue is still there. Yeah. yeah. So if you're smoking like through like say say you're smoking just like a joint, you know, it's like a paper. It's not yeah, as bad yeah, as smoking yeah. it from like a. You know, you get a switch your sweet and take the tobacco out. Well, let me let me look this up. And then when you go into like the harder drugs, like oh, yeah. the the stuff that like it, like it causes like paranoia, uh, okay. like hallucinations. Yeah. And then like your judgment like becomes impaired. Of course. You, you just start like assuming. Yeah. yeah. You know. What was I gonna say? But you can be addicted to anything. Like we this this yeah, whole we episode just, yeah. we just and- went a bunch. We just went into detail on three different subtopics. When there's even more topics like that, we could go into detail. Yeah, a lot but we of chose them. these three just because to us it was like the main. Yeah, the main, the most common. The most common, yeah. right? Um, but one thing that I would say, like, because there's a lot of people that would that say they're not addicted or they're like, oh, you can't be addicted. For example, a lot of people be like, you can't be addicted to weed, but it's like, yes, you can. That's true. Yeah. Like, not, if, if not physically, depend- not physically, yeah. but. If you're dependent yeah. on it, and if you can't go like a couple, like dude, you're addicted. Like, it's, like, it's like I need I, it to relax. It's like, yeah, okay, well, um, then you're addicted. Like, but I don't know why some people are, like, I don't, I don't think shame. smoking weed is like that bad. Uh, a lot of people say, oh, it's a gateway to other drugs. But like for me, I don't think smoking weed is bad. But like when someone is to the point where they're like, dude, I'm smoking this, or dude, I need weed to calm down. I need weed this. I'm not like, bro. The heck, like, but you know what's the real yeah, gateway? Like, smoke weed to have fun, right? Like you say, like, come on. No, you like, know what's the the no, real no, gateway? Oh, go go go. One last thing I would say before um, passing it on to y'all is like, I know weed is also like a medicinal drug, so a lot of people use it for uh, eating disorders, eat it for or use it for um, pain relief and stuff like that. Usually, it's and creams and edibles. Now, creams, and edibles, and you could do you could smoke it too, but it's like um, you know, there's t- CBD and that that's like more for the like creams and kind of shit but um yeah but like when someone's like oh i need it for this i need it for that and uh i mean i don't know it's just an excuse yeah yeah can i i don't know what you're saying go ahead but like you just said like uh how it's medicinal Mm -hmm. a lot of medicines people get addicted to too like it's like yeah, they're spreading it to us on purpose like they're spreading a lot of stuff to us on purpose oh yeah because even weed is more accessible you got home. nicotine they got they got pins they got flums and all that like everything's more and you don't even know now. the chemicals that they have in this shit yeah, yeah exactly you know it's it's, it's why oh my it's, it's why it's why i always say like i always ask everyone like I, i've asked you i was like can you get off of it and like why do you use it i asked everybody yeah, that was you asked shit. me that like, and people give me the reason and i take the word for it right vape, so especially vape, especially vape. more you because i trust you but like i i'm just biased i guess towards it you could say it but just like I don't see no benefit at all to it to use mm-hmm. weed. No benefit. Yeah. Like uh, and there's nothing that would change my mind. I, yeah, know? I wouldn't even try to convince you, bro. No. I mean, like I wouldn't wanna, you know. Yeah. What was I saying? Like I feel like the like, talking about gateway shit. I feel like the gateway thing for a lot of people who do hard drugs, not weed, mm-hmm. but like hard drugs is like college, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Real That's shit. True. That's true. Because no, because weed, bro. You most of the time, not everyone. No one's gonna go farther than shit. weed, bro. My 60 year old neighbor. I said this last time. She be smoking hella, and then, uh, well, not like, was you know she does her occasional. Like I yeah. see her like on the on on the week. I see her probably like two or three times outside smoking. Yeah, because uh, it's like Adderall. Isn't that like a uh, uh under the umbrella of meth too? Yeah. It so is. It's, yeah, Adderall? and Adderall is like it's supposed. A lot of college students use it to focus, and that's where they go from Adderall to fucking meth to. Ow. And another thing, is all those drugs. Try they try something just to try it, just to have fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and then they realize like I'm kind of well, not even realize. And, they, and they just think can't about get that thing you said. Just like 
that that falls into the peer pressure, like the people they hang around with, which is why the example of college is is, yeah. is a good one. The addiction to peer and, pressure in in the Midwest, people do heroin or like like yeah, crystal, that's, that's like that's as, a, as as like a recreational shit. Yeah. And p- people that get addicted to it usually like, oh yeah, the first time it was it wasn't really my thing, like I didn't like it, but the second time I tried it, so, they said oh, so they, they said oh boy, <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Let me tell you, so weird though. Like, the first if you time? didn't like it the first time, why'd you do it the second time? I guess they just because yeah. I mean. I feel like with weed, you try to you try to weed. Oh, like before, they probably right? was like, they oh, yeah, can you say it, recreational? So it's, it's like, just, it. just it's just, out there. yeah. I get Because yeah, it's see. the Midwest. There's nothing to do. They have <laughs> to do something with it. That makes sense. You yeah. want to go look at the cows over there? Like, what the fuck? No, literally, that's that's why they have so such high uh, meth uh, rates or whatever. Yeah. Well, I, I did see that heroin is like amongst, like from, since it's like, since it's dropped, <laughs> just like, <laughs> since it's like been around, it's still like, the leader in like deaths and stuff and I dig I want to see it, how, you, how it feels you know right. um it's a recent well right. not recent but fentanyl is like catching up and yeah. especially with re- the like the recent years fentanyl is catching up to heroin I like super crazy it's cause rates. I feel like, like cause they're cutting shit with it though not necessarily cause people want to try yeah it's cause it's like yeah. but they're, you know they're people- being unknowingly how do you say addicted to it mm-hmm. you know yeah. what I'm saying well, a lot of a lot of fentanyl is like um how do you say it like a lot of stuff is fa- laced with yeah, 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 yeah. they couldn't yeah, shit yeah, with it. Yeah. And uh, I actually saw that in San Francisco last month alone, like forty, yeah, forty five people overdosed off of fentanyl, and it's like last month, just like, but that's just like reported people like been found on the streets. Like, just imagine like people like who like fall into something, get lost. I'm like, damn. Bro, I mean, that stuff doesn't sick. make it any easier either. You know yeah. what I mean? They're handing out needles and shit, helping druggies. Oh uh, yeah, that too. It's kind of like they give you five hundred bucks a week to be homeless over there. Yeah, I think all might move over. Hey, there, why do they do that? <laughs> like, just think about it. They want it, you to be relying on. This is the thing, like with all this shit, like when the are like addicted to anything that is bad for you, is like it sounds disrespectful, but it's because you don't think, right? It's like I said, it's simple. But it's like you're not like why, why, like with the food, why are the portion sizes this big? here in this country like why why do they promote certain shit like why you have to you have to ask yourself why right mm-hmm. try to put it all together put the puzzles connect the dots and then be like oh they're fucking they're trying to fuck me yeah because right. 500 bucks a, a week is not that's an amount to live off in simple it's a yeah. week that's two thousand that's thousand i thought you said a month no 500 bucks oh no, did i say a month yeah. no a week it, it, a it week. varies for 500 dollars yeah, a week some places up to 750 Maybe. Living better than us, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm be Gavin Newsom, bro. Homeless. Gavin Newsom. You're like, who do you vote for? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, well. So I can see right. right here you voted for my recall. Uh, <laughs> see, you ain't getting shit, my boy. Oh, I forgot about that shit. That's, That's crazy. crazy. But uh, I think we touched everything pretty, pretty, much. pretty good. You touched everything? You touching yourself bro, too much? Damn, Damn bro. Too much. That was weird, bro. <laughs> I mean, I feel, like, I feel like drugs is different, though. We didn't really touch on how to, like... Yeah, it gets a little more complicated because we can't be like, oh, bro, you got to be strong, bro, in your head. Yeah, because <laughs> yeah. the drugs. When it gets to substance abuse, <laughs> right. it's like there's not much we can actually say because, like, how many of us have done anything harder than weed? Like, we can't Nothing. really even like Nicotine. get into that. <laughs> <laughs> like, we can't really get into that. Um, I would say from like personal experience, I I wouldn't be able to tell you just like stuff I've yeah. read, stuff I've seen. I like, but like personal experience, I can't, I cannot tell yeah, you. We gotta tell, we I go think, up to heroin I addict. I think with people with drugs, and stop being per- a bitch. <laughs> and tell me if you think I'm wrong. It's just like something happened in the life that made them switch it. Right? It's mm-hmm. like they, it made them, it made them think, be like, I gotta get off this shit now, right? Yeah. Right. And then that's how they get off of it. That's yeah. that's just the stories that I see from people like that get off of it. That's like some yeah, like something happens and they're like, dude, I can't. It, and, it, and it hit them. Yeah. It hit them and they're like, oh shit. Because right? I, I, that happened to my dad, bro. He yeah. well, we it, drinking? for him it was alcohol, and he got he got like a couple tickets or whatnot. And then there was one time where he was about to get deported, bro. And he was like, bro, I gotta stop. And then from that moment he stopped because he had he literally had um, house arrest, so he had like two, <laughs> bro. For for drinking, he had two uh, ankle monitors, bro. Damn, so, two ankle no, monitors. No, wait, I'm what? Like, what that shit hell uncomfortable. I don't know. <laughs> and then from that moment, he was like, "Bro, I can't drink no more," because he saw like 
damn, it was like hella bad. But like it had, like for him, it had to get to that point for him to switch, you know? So yeah. like sometimes people can't just be like, you know what? I'm going to quit. It, like something has to happen. Yeah, just lock so. him in a cell. Let him, uh, <laughs> let him hang out, you know, dry we out. Didn't, for... We didn't touch on withdrawals, bro. Yeah. That's oh, that's it. a whole different topic in yeah, itself, you withdrawals know? Withdrawals. Well, I heard, I, I, I've listened to Recovering Addicts. Uh, you guys listen to White Soft Underbelly? Oh, I've seen a couple of these. Yeah, yeah, I love that guy. I've been watching him for like a couple years now. And, uh, you know, oh, fuck, what I was going to say? Damn. Withdrawal. Oh, wait, well, 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 the addicts, uh, something they always say is uh, you're, you're never really out of it. You know, you just oh. take big breaks in between them. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, Especially with hard drugs. That's sad and yeah. like scary that's, that's to be here. They, they said you could never, you're never really yeah. off of uh, you're always thinking about dude and one yeah. example one example i, I don't want to but breaking bad remember <laughs> <laughs> hey, spoilers spoilers uh for season four of breaking bad um, but so so jesse the he was into like hero or or he, heroin no, heroin right yeah and he was like clean for hella years and then he met his like a girl or his girlfriend at the time like she was also she was also clean but then they they were celebrating and then they, they pulled out the heroin and he's like oh, I don't know like I haven't done it she's like I haven't done it either and then they, then they do it bro. And started is that the one, started is that that one, that's the one where you floats yeah that's yeah, the yeah. one that's the meme floats, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, I feel like I want to do heroin now but, <laughs> but that, ties in, that ties into like Not the, example, the, example, example, the example the example that one thing is like <laughs> with the college like it's it's who you hang around with too right right this right. is a whole different uh, topic too but like this is my problem too with mental health like a lot of people blame the mental health shit but they'll never blame, blame it on the people that they hang around with who are bad influences well you gotta be strong too cause a few motherfuckers one day were like oh for sure we're like pre we're about to record you're like hey you wanna do something but you become you become strong minded <laughs> because of the individuals you hang around with right yeah you can't, you can't let them push around make yeah. them do shit you don't want exactly. to yeah. Yeah. when they wanna bring heroin and test all you guys <laughs> <laughs> I'll put that it. shit in your water we're gonna do a drug test bro. <laughs> See, take, see take who's lying see no but, but but i seen you guys like go like oh my when i said i want to see what it feels like but i just want to see what like I, i'm not gonna do it obviously but i just want to see what's so addicting about it like what what well uh, yeah well know? yeah i guess because media well, yeah, will depict think, it I didn't, I didn't even hear you <laughs> but to insinuate that it's kind of oh he did like he did. media oh. media will depict something but it's different for everything because for like dmt and you know like um hallucinogenics you know, there's people that glorify it. There's people that, yeah. like, oh, yeah. dude, my trips were amazing. My trips were awesome. But then there's people that were like, nah, bro. So sometimes it's like, bro, who do I listen to? Like, if you do want to try it, like, I'm not trying to experience that. I'm I, trying to experience this. But I I, if I do, it. if I do do it and I experience this, like, what the fuck, right? But I hear that it's also based on how, how healthy you are up here. Uh, but th but th think about what you said. You said, who do I listen to? Think about think about that. <laughs> Who do I listen to? Can you some water? Don't listen to nobody. That's the that's the that's the story of the yeah. day. The message of the day. You you gotta push your own. Keep passing on. You gotta set your own guidelines pa for your pa own pass life. The weed, pass the weed. Wait wait. But what if my guidelines? <laughs> what if my guidelines? Let me get hit of that. It's lean in there. What if my guidelines are do heroin all day? That's still, that's still your, listen to my own shit. That's your guideline. You just know my mean? own good. Psychedelics seem cool to me though. Like, yeah, I psychedelics I, look I like the this coolest for thing. Felix, right? He always thought I was on his dick and shit when I was telling him to stop cigarettes, right? Still on my dick. Whatever. I'm just joking. But like for Bobby and Weezy, because well, when I be running a lot, I, I'm not, I'm being dead honest, bro. I see so many fat guys smoking cigarettes outside, and I'm be like, bro, somewhere in their life they got fucked up and they became this. And, and then they're wearing their mask and they're like, because they care about their yeah, health. Yeah, like I'm like, bro, this is so sad to see them like that. Like, and they don't give a fuck, right? Yeah. I mean, they gave up. They give up already. You're done? Give up. They're like 30s. It's like, it's done. Right. 30s? <laughs> your life's just starting in your 30s. Facts. <laughs> well, I don't know about just starting, but... I mean, yeah, but you still got a long way to go. Yeah. That ties into the rules that people want to put on life when there's no rules to life, right? Yeah. All right. Like but, 30s, my life is over. I mean, I've, uh, I feel like I wouldn't want to make it to 30, but... <laughs> but yeah. Are we kind of chatting right yeah. now? Yeah, I we're chatting. That was a good episode. But uh, I think we touched in deep on every subtopic um and like we said at the beginning take it with the brain of salt if you got disrespected i don't apologize personally mm -hmm. um we weren't trying to also, and if you're also, addicted to drugs yeah. get off that shit junkie oh <laughs> is that now if you if you yourself are struggling with any kind of substance uh, you know there's there's help so 
Yeah, it's just right. about one. We'll, we'll put the we'll put the head number, over, in, the over, we'll Ramon, put the number in the bio. Too. We'll put the number in the bio. Right. Is the number for that? For <laughs> addiction? Yeah. Literally just search fuck up. them. No, just no. Fuck, you, no, fuck, up. No, 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 fuck no. up. Call Ramon. Fuck that. Are yeah, call Ramon. Are useless. But if you if you literally because I to do, uh, fuck no, them. No, no, to do research uh, fuck to do, them to do research I fuck searched them. up what is addictive for today's episode and literally it gave me the number like first thing Google gave me the I number. I wonder what they tell you if you call they're like have you tried not doing it like <laughs> fuck they're useless they're useless <laughs> useless I don't want to be like, alive being a bitch. I'm like, not doing it useless. all right yeah but thank you guys for watching this latest episode uh see you later y'all.